for your gracious care and service towards your fellow man by sharing your strength, ability, and unselfish attitude, I, John Lewis, Mayor of the Town of Gilbert, wish to give you this award. Spencer, he, he didn't ask for any of this. When he said, I want to do a triathlon with Dayton, um, he didn't want any of this attention. But he, uh, he did it because he likes Dayton. I met Dayton in our Deacon's Corps at church. When I got called to be the Deacon's Corps president, I felt a great sense of responsibility on my shoulders that I should be watching out for everybody in the Corps. Dayton has cerebral palsy. He can't talk or uh, communicate that well, but you can feel his spirit wherever he is. He's a great friend to me. He should have the opportunity to do what everybody else does. We've always tried to include him in everything that we do. Um, along the way, we found out that uh, he just loves the wind in his face. Spencer knelt down right in front of Dayton and grabbed him on his knees and he said, Dayton, would you like to do a triathlon with me? Dayton doesn't communicate other than he'll blink for yes and he won't blink for no. And he started blinking and he said, Dad, he said yes. It was a different experience than the other triathlons I've done because when I got on that bike, it felt harder pulling someone else with me the entire way. I knew that Dayton was within five feet of me the whole time, and it was awesome to know that there was someone else there, one of my really good friends that could be with me. I've learned great lessons of love and uh, a boy that does what Christ would do if he were here. And um, fulfilling his responsibility as a, as a Deacon's Corn president, as a friend. Near the finish line was very spiritual for Dayton and I because I felt that I was like out of juice, I was out of energy, but then like I don't even know where it came from. Dayton started smiling and I started to speed up and I had the energy to sprint the last few hundred yards into the finish line, and I just felt great at the finish line. I didn't feel like I was drained of my energy. I felt that the spirit was there helping Dayton and I to finish that race. He doesn't want to look like the hero at all. He wants Dayton to look like the hero, and he's just Dayton's legs. <laughs>